Strider has called for the Pacers, and it's post time. Third race Pacers are all in behind the starting gate, and uh, here they come. And they're off. And going for the early lead is G.A.'s Lynette up on the outside along the inside, Lady Arlene, and in between, Acer's Pacer. They round the clubhouse turn, and that is Lady Arlene pacing to the front. Up on the outside, G.A.'s Lynette moves into second. Acer's Pacer down at the rail is in third, and then it's back to Mertz Flirt completing the first four. Followed in fifth by K.B.'s Fran along the inside, Dancing Nucleus is sixth. Jeannie's Bade out of the gate seventh. Barb's Love and Flying Bowl trail the field. They straighten up onto the backstretch, going the opening quarter behind G.A.'s. Lynette is Lady Arlene in second. They race by the quarter in 31-2. and two. And now Lady Arlene steps to the outside and reclaims the lead from G.A.'s Lynette. Along the inside, Acer's Pacer is the third. Merch Flirt racing in fourth, followed by K.B. Sprand completing the top five. Dancing Nucleus is racing in sixth. Genie's Mate is in seventh. Barb's Love is eighth, and a Flying Bold trails the field. They are racing midway up the back stretch, and Lady Arlene has reclaimed the lead. G.A.'s Lynette racing in second. Acer's Pacer down at the rail is in third. Mertz Flirt completes the first four. And then it's back to KB Fran racing in fifth. Up on the outside, going uh, quickly as Barb's Love into the first six. And then racing seventh is uh, Genie's Maid. On the outside, Flying Bold moves into eighth, and Dancing Nucleus didn't move quick enough and has shuffled back and now trails. Half time, a leisurely 104 and 1. They just strolled up the backside behind the lead of Lady Arlene. And now Lady Arlene has opened up a length and a half lead. Barb's Love up on the outside is uh, into second. At the rail, GA's Lynette is racing in third. Jeannie's Maid's into the action fourth. Acer's Pacer shuffled back at the rail, racing in fifth. And now they're at the top of the home stretch, three quarters and 135 and three. Tony Morgan has managed to turn this one into a quarter mile dash to the wire with Lady Arlene, two to the good. They race down to the final eighth of a mile and Lady Arlene has the lead. G.A.'s Lynette racing second through the center of the track. Dancing Nucleus is gaining ground. Into the final 16th, Lady Arlene has the lead. G.A.'s Lynette closing along the rail. It's Lady Arlene, G.A.'s Lynette. And on the outside, Acer's Pacer coming on. G.A.'s Lynette and Lady Arlene hit the line and a photo finish. Number four, G.A.'s Lynette was first. Number one, Lady Arlene was second. Number two, Acer's Pacer was third. And uh, number three, Mertz Flirt finished fourth. And now in the winter circle is G.A.'s Lynette. G.A.'s Lynette is a four-year-old filly by closing out of Bid Blessing, who is by Doc Bell. Owned by Delmar Pletcher and trained by the owner, Dave McGee, with the winning drive. In the winter circle is G.A.'s Lynette. The fourth race starts the early pick three. There are no changes in race four. In the fifth race, there are no changes. In the sixth race, the final leg of the early pick three, scratch the three, Google Girl.